Can I use baking powder instead of baking soda? Hello there, home cooks and baking enthusiasts. Today, we'll be tackling a common question that comes up in the world of baking. Can I use baking powder instead of baking soda? What is baking soda? Baking soda, also known as sodium bicarbonate, is a base mineral which, when combined with something acidic, produces carbon dioxide. The carbon dioxide then creates bubbles, leading to the expansion of a dough or batter. This is how your baked goods get that fluffy, airy texture we all love. It's important to note that baking soda is four times stronger than baking powder, meaning you need less baking soda to achieve the same level of rising. What is baking powder? Baking powder is a complete leavening agent. It contains both an acid and a base, and also includes a bit of cornstarch to keep the ingredients stable. Baking powder starts a chemical reaction when it comes into contact with liquid, then produces more carbon dioxide when the batter is heated. So, it's a double acting agent. Can you substitute baking powder for baking soda? Yes and no. Because baking powder is less potent than baking soda, you might need up to four times as much baking powder to achieve the same effect. This might not be a problem for some recipes, but in others, it could affect the taste and texture. Moreover, remember that baking powder contains an acid. If you're replacing baking soda with baking powder in a recipe that already has an acidic ingredient, like lemon juice, vinegar, or buttermilk, you may end up with a final product that's too acidic. What if I need to substitute baking soda for baking powder? This substitution is trickier. Baking soda needs an acid to create the necessary carbon dioxide for leavening. If your recipe doesn't contain an acid, you'll need to add one, like lemon juice or cream of tartar, when you substitute baking soda for baking powder. The rule of thumb is to use about a quarter teaspoon of baking soda for every teaspoon of baking powder required. In summary, while it's technically possible to substitute baking powder for baking soda, and vice versa, the results might not always be what you expect. This is because the two leavening agents are chemically different, leading to different reactions and results in your baking. So, for the best results, always stick to the recipe whenever you can. Happy baking!